Hey Gogol, I have a puzzle for you. Join the dots with a line and find out what figure is hidden here. Okay, let me try. Toggle, it is a computer mouse. Yes, it's a computer mouse. Very similar to the one attached to your computer. Oh yes, Toggle, can you tell me how to use this mouse? Sure, Goggle. A computer mouse is a pointing device. It may have two or more buttons. The button on the left is the left button. And the button on the right is the right button. Hmm, what is that wheel in the middle, Toggle? That is a wheel called the stroll wheel. A modern mouse, like the one you have here, has two buttons and a scroll wheel at the center. Okay, but what is the use of this wheel? The scroll wheel helps us to move up or down a page on a computer monitor. Goggle, the computer mouse, has to be placed properly in front of the computer. Really? But how? The mouse is usually placed on a flat, thin pad called a mouse pad. This makes its movement smooth. Though nowadays, the mouse you get can be used without a mouse pad also. Okay! Also, the buttons of the mouse should always point towards the computer. The mouse should not be turned sideways or turned over while in use. Proper way to hold the mouse. Oh, is that so? Yes, Goggle. The mouse will be used differently by different people. Why? See, Goggle. Some people are left-handed and some people are right-handed. Look at this picture of our hands on the monitor. This picture shows both our hands with each finger numbered. So why is this important? Now, say Greena is left-handed and Arif is right-handed. Each will hold the mouse with different fingers of their hands. Rita will hold the mouse by putting finger 3 on the left button and finger 4 on the right button of the mouse. Got it! So Arif, who is a right-hander, will use finger 7 on the left button and finger 8 on the right button of the mouse. That's right! You are smart, Goggle. Thanks! But how does holding the mouse correctly Help us in using the computer. By correctly holding the mouse, you will find it easier to point at things on the computer monitor. And it helps you click the mouse correctly to do the things you want to do on the computer. How does the mouse help us in pointing at things on the computer? Look at the monitor. You will see an arrow on the screen. Yes, I can see one. The arrow that you see on the monitor screen is the mouse pointer. When you move the mouse on the mouse pad, the mouse pointer on the monitor also moves. If you press a button on the computer mouse, you hear a click. This is called clicking the mouse. Toggle, what are the left and right buttons used for? Goggle. When we use a mouse, a pointer appears on the screen. The pointer helps to point at and select objects on the screen. The left and the right buttons are used for mouse actions. There are four mouse actions. Click, double click, right click, drag and drop. To click, gently press left mouse button once and release it. On doing this, 
the mouse makes a clicking sound a click is generally used to select an item on the monitor okay and how do we double click it to double click gently press the left mouse button twice within a short period of time and release it double click is generally used to open a file a folder or a program so toggle if i take the mouse pointer to the computer icon on the desktop and double click it the computer window will appear yes goggle that's what will happen now to right click press and release the right mouse button once right clicking shows a list of things one can do it is a list of commands from which you can choose the needed one finally drag and drop is used to move an item from one position to another on the monitor with the help of the mouse okay how's that done toggle it is done in three steps place the mouse pointer on any icon let us choose the computer icon here press and hold the left mouse button still holding the button drag the icon to the position where you want the computer icon to be release the mouse button can i try it sure goggle so goggle that's the computer mouse for you all clear yes toggle thanks for all your help